My favorite kind of golf course is the kind that resembles a time machine. Places like the Aiken Golf Club. The city of Aiken, South Carolina sits just across the Savannah River from Augusta, Georgia. And like the city just to the south, it's eaten up with golf. People flock to the region each year as fans of the Masters, and when they do, many of them bring their golf clubs in tow. There are many places that people can choose to play, but for my money, the Aiken Golf Club is the place to be. You won't find perfectly manicured fairways and flawless greens here, but what you will discover is a trip into the past, a place that reveres history and one of the more creative layouts and routings that you'll ever find in the South. Everything about the Aiken Golf Club feels like it's been frozen in time. It's an opportunity to step back into a different day when golf was not all about how far you could hit it and what kind of shape the course was in, but more of a place and an opportunity to spend time with friends and explore a property and get to know somewhere for everything that makes it special. The Aiken Golf Club is quirky in all the right ways. And those characteristics reveal themselves to everyone who plays, starting with the first hole. Double greens are typically found in places far away like Scotland and England, but in Aiken, South Carolina, you'll approach one just on the first hole where the green shares a putting surface with the 17th hole. In Aiken, you'll find blind tee shots and sharp dog legs, all of which lead to revealing beautiful vistas of the South Carolina countryside. This beautiful walk through nature is amplified by interesting topography and other fascinating landforms that abut the golf course, such as the railroad track that borders the third green. The Aiken Golf Club has a timeless feel. It stays true to its golden age founding, and much of the work done in recent decades has been done by the owner, Jim McNair, all on his own. The detail work of the golf course that has been done by McNair and his entire team at the club is simply outstanding. These enhancements marry perfectly to other historic elements at the club to create a special ambiance that is particularly enjoyed when walking the golf course. Ball. Keep trying. The golf course is filled with variety and despite having a short yardage on all 18 holes, it keeps the golfer's attention from start to finish. Winding through pines and sandy hills, the course reveals itself one hole at a time to be something with a kind of old magic, the kind of which has gone extinct in many places. The golf course winds through the property in a very memorable manner, taking the golfer on an exploration of the property that will leave you longing for a return trip. Over. 
the closing stretch of the golf course allows for the skilled player to show off their scoring ability. Back-to-back -back drivable par fours both present birdie opportunities. The routing of the golf course also comes to a crescendo as some of the best views and vistas on the property are at hand through the final holes. With all you can play rates coming in at much less than $50, it's likely that you'll find yourself like I did chasing sundown and wishing you had more time to play. As you crest the hill on the 17th hole at Aiken Golf Club, the clubhouse comes back into view. With a short par three taking you back to the clubhouse, the Aiken Golf Club leaves you with one last opportunity to find some excitement in your round. One last reminder of why you should come back soon.